Hello everyone. Namaskaram. This is Throbbing Nature, a channel which shares the explorations, experiences and learnings of two naturalists during their prolonged careers throughout the Indian jungles. In those two, I am Jason and behind the camera filming me, my friend and colleague Mr. Narendra. Eyes of the jungle, that's the tag given to the langurs. It is because they make alarm calls by sitting on the top of the trees when they spot predators. Other animals also get benefited with this distressed call. Having said this, leopards are evolved with excellent skills in hunting these watchful eyes. Today, throbbing nature shares some interesting wildlife moments of a leopard with its langur king. It was a cloudy morning. The leopard caught the langur deep in the forest amongst the rocks on a small hill. To prey upon the kill, it conveniently selected the shade of a large dead tree. After ensuring there was no threat around from other predators and scavengers, it started to feast on the kill. The first job was to remove the langus fur more or less completely before consuming the fleshy parts. And for this, the leopard used its teeth and tongue. The rough texture on the tongue helps the leopard to do that. If the prey is any kind of monkeys compared to any other herbivores, they start to feed the head first. Starting from the top of the head, going round and round down to the bottom. At this moment, it has started feeding the skull, brain, ears and then eventually moved towards the nose and mouth. We were able to watch the lungu's mouth opening and closing as the predator's canines crushed the upper jaw bones. Every now and then it ensured there was no disturbances around. This young female leopard could not swallow the skull due to its larger size. It then regurgitated and made it into small pieces and swallowed again.
After completing the head, it continues to feed on the rest of the body parts. Though heard a lot about the tongue adaptation of a cat for feeding on its prey, it was the first time we could witness it. The tongue of a cat has tiny backward facing barbs called papillae which make it easier to rasp the meat from the bones of its prey. We could see it ripping out the internal body parts with the help of the front teeth. It was the second purpose of the same teeth apart from stripping off the fur as we have seen earlier. The leopard used its extremely sharp teeth which are located along the sides of its jaws for cutting the flesh and bones. We could watch this special sighting for more than one hour which made our day. Having fed well it climbed onto a rock nearby to take some rest. For not losing the precious food, it's better to relax as close to the carcass as possible because it is the uncertain wild nature around. We went to the same spot in the afternoon with the expectation of filming, 
the rest of the sequence. But the leopard had already vanished across the hills with its precious kill. As we all know that wildlife does not behave according to our wish and convenience. Hope you all have enjoyed today's video. It's Jason and Narain signing off. Until we are back with some unique moments from the wild.